you know, it's one thing when somebody who knows you and knows what maybe you've been into that hadn't been the best thing walks up to you and says, you need to quit that or you need to change. You need to change yourself so you don't do that anymore. It's one thing when somebody comes up to us fussing at us that we need to quit something. And then when somebody else comes up and says, there's a power available to you as a follower of the Lord Jesus Christ that will do the change in you, be changed by the power of the Spirit of Jesus at work in our heart. The Apostle Paul says in Romans 12, don't, don't be conformed to this world, to the image of this world, but then he makes this statement, you be transformed by the renewing of your mind so that you may prove what the will of God is, that which is good and acceptable and perfect. Well, well who is the one who renews our minds? And it's, it's this passive verb that, that it's something outside of the person is to be acting upon the person to perform that action of, of transforming, of being, tra you, you, are, you allow yourself to be transformed by an outside power. Who is the outside power? Titus 3 says that it is the Spirit of Jesus, the exalted Jesus Christ, alive by His Spirit inside you, that will do the work of renewing your mind, renewing our minds, the way we think, the way we feel, what we choose. So it's, there's all the difference in the world. Jesus is, is our Savior. He, he, he died for our sins to be forgiven. We put our trust in Him as Savior. But I don't know how many of us are putting our trust in him to do the rest of what the gospel contains and speaks of. Jesus is our changer. He's the one who will change us. He works by his spirit to change our want to. What we thought we couldn't live without, as he gets to work inside us, it's amazing how he can just put to death those things change those things in us that we thought we couldn't live without, those desires. There's, there's more that we talk about in, in the further message. Click on the, on the instructions below if you'd like to go further with us. It, it's not about you change yourself, you quit that, you change yourself. It's about the power of the Lord Jesus Christ being turned loose inside you to change you. Oh, what a difference that is. God bless you. God bless you.